What have you brought here? I've brought a portrait of Duke of Cambridge, Will, and the Duchess of Cambridge, Kate Middleton, using cream crackers. <laughs> <laughs> crackers? Made out of crackers? Yes, completely. <laughs> when you think you've seen it all. I studied fine art at Carter School of Art and Design, so full, fully graduated, and now I'm a full-time professional artist. I got a little bit bored of using paints and pencils and decided to go a little bit more extreme and use food materials and everything I can find around the house. You may be able to find oil paintings of Kate and Will, but who else can say they have a cream cracker portrait of them? So why on earth do you use food to do art? I think of the celebrity that I like to create to start with and then think of a different odd material that would relate to them. So I thought iconic British characters with an iconic British cracker. It's almost like a sort of a yay Britain sort of piece. So who else have you painted? It's been several other things like David Beckham, famous for playing football, so painted him with my feet. Miley Cyrus is famous for poking her tongue out, so I made her with my own tongue. You paint with your tongue? Yeah, it's literally putting the paint on the end of my tongue and lifting the canvas, yeah. <laughs> How do, you, how do you make them? Where would you start doing something like that? I sketch up the, the initial portrait, yeah. and then it's essentially with this, I've used PVA glue almost as a paint, and then crumpled up the crackers using my hands and a rolling pin, and then sort of attached it in. Can I come over and have a little feel? Of course you can, definitely. Don't pick bits off. Yeah. I'm hungry. No, don't. Remember, they're coated with something. <laughs> yeah. and obviously, a good thing about food art as well is that it still generally smells quite a lot like the product. A little snip of your crackers. Yeah, you go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Smells like creams, cream crackers. And how much are you asking for them? I would like about a thousand pounds for them both. For two big pieces of art, that's mm -hmm. that's a good price, to Is be it? quite honest. Really, yeah. If it was not made out of crackers. <laughs> would you take five hundred pounds? No, I wouldn't know. I mean, my concern is the perishable. We've never really left a food item of any description out for more than 10 minutes about Mark eating it. OK. <laughs> um, I'm worried that these might come back and Kate will be missing a cheek. Um, can you go down any from 1,000? I think that now my name and my work is getting out there enough that I think I should stick to around that. I think we're going to have to give it a pass on the cream crackers, as much as I love them. Yeah. We don't really have the clientele for cracker portraits around here. Right. But hang on, you do commission deals? Yes, that's right. What do you get the man who's got everything for his birthday? Oh, good thinking. What, can you knock up in a couple of hours for an old man for his birthday? Depends what we have around. Ketchup, chocolate, coffee, anything in the kitchen. We've got loads We've of got coffee. We've got loads of coffee. Coffee? Be brilliant. Yeah. You'll get us out of a hole as well. What price would you put on it? Probably say for the coffee portrait, maybe, maybe about two hundred pounds or so. Okay, oh, awesome. Nathan, yeah, no we'll problem that. then. That'd be uh, really cool. Awesome. Thanks, Thank you so much. Right. Awesome. Go and send them. Let's to get the, the coffee. Come into the kitchen cool. with me. I'll show you where all the coffee is. Crackers. There's something else. What do you get the man who's got everything? Look. Oh. It's made out of coffee. That's really good. I like that, actually. A coffee painting. Well, I asked him to put a few less wrinkles on than he has done. <laughs> <laughs> Don't coffee? smell it. That's really good. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. Yay. Thank Yay. you. You're trying to get an old car, and you feel the heat coming off that. Oh, yeah. Yay, look yeah. at that smoke. <laughs> oh, God! The smoke alarm! <laughs> <laughs> well, now I do feel old. Get me. <laughs> <laughs>